Hello and welcome to My Yellow Table. Cooking can be a tiresome process, especially when you have to do it three times a day, every day. But what if you were to invite a good friend of yours into your kitchen to help you out so that khana bhi bane, baate bhi ho jaye, aur bhot maza bhi aaye. And our guest today is a very dear friend of mine who writes cookbooks, has her own blog, is a TV artist, is a chef of her own home, and she loves cooking. Hello. Hi. Thank you. What have you been doing to yourself? You're just squeezing. You. It's like reverse age. You're going back to college. Yeah, it's a Benjamin Button phenomenon. <laughs> no, Where do you actually, get that from? I want that. I you mean, want that? You you look absolutely fabulous without doing it. I'm getting fat on the show. I've been eating so much. Everyone who eats gets fat. So what I do is, when I go through a binge, then I run. Fantastic. So what's happening? I've been checking out lately that you've been so much into food now. You're so aggressive. So was it always that you? Had this in mind that you wanted to do something with food? No, actually, I've I've been somebody who likes to eat. I hmm. love to eat, and I love to eat good food. Okay. And I realized the only way I can always get what I want to eat is if I learn to cook. Uh huh. But I did not start cooking hmm. because of that. Hmm. So when my son turned about two and a half, that's when they start eating. Right. I realized he I don't know how to make food. उससे पहले मतलब इतना आइडिया नहीं था उससे पहले एक्चुअली मैं बनाती थी लेकिन बहुत कम देन आई गॉन ऑफ टू लंडन आई वाज प्रेग्नेंट विद माय डॉटर या एंड व्हेन आई वेंट देयर आई हैड नथिंग टू डू सो मी एंड माय सन यूज्ड टू रोम अराउंड हां सो आई स्टार्टेड गेटिंग इनटू फार्मर्स मार्केट्स एंड आई यूज्ड टू लव द प्रोड्यूस इट वाज बी सो प्रिटी या या सो आई यूज्ड टू बाय इट बिकॉज़ इट वाज वेरी प्रिटी बट नाउ व्हाट टू डू विद एग्जैक्टली मैं वापस आके मैं गूगल कर Mm-hmm. Hey, what is this? How do I cook this? Okay. What is that? How do I and cook that? Start experimenting. So that is how I start. Cooking. You know what? Sometimes uh, it's not just the uh, thought or the hunger that drives you. It's just that beautiful produce you see yes. and you get excited. Now, yes. Look at these pretty colors, yeah. I love this. All of these colors are part of the menu today that we're doing. It's fantastic. The menu today is pineapple rosemary cooler, carrot and plum soup. caramelized onion and a cheese paratha the stuff mini pumpkin with tomato and nice. cheese so sabse pehle kya karte hain let's start with the pumpkin yeah, and the, the carrot soup yeah we'll just cut it from the center okay beech mein se ekdam all right so pretty much what we're going to do is go and take out the seeds first हम फटाफट मैरिनेट करेंगे थोड़ा सा ऑयल आई लाइक दिस बिना मेजरमेंट वाला कुकिंग आई थिंक इट्स मोर गैनिक एंड टेस्टी इंट्यूटिव या आई लाइक इंट्यूटिव कुकिंग सो इफ यू कैन टेक सम सेज देयर ऑलराइट जस्ट ब्रेक इट एंड जस्ट ड्रॉप इट ऑन टू दिस सो आई एम एडिंग सम सॉल्ट सेज और पंकिन इज अ ग्रेट फ्लेवर यस ओके आई हैव गॉट सम गार्लिक वी जस्ट स्मैश इट एंड जस्ट ड्रॉप इट ऑन टू द पंपकिन थोड़ा सा पेपर पाउडर अब इसको ओवन में डाल देते हैं अबाउट 170 डिग्रीज और राइट सो पंपकिन गोज इन इसकी स्टफिंग बनानी है और कैरेट एंड प्लम सूप नॉ फॉर दैट वी नीड सम कैरेट कैरेट्स नाइस यू हैव रेड एंड ऑरेंज या फैबुलस I can use an onion. So how did you get interested in food? I mean, I'm a commerce student. I was never good with numbers, so it was like a lot and lot of practice, and everybody trying to teach me at home, especially my father. <laughs> and you know, even after getting admission, I thought I don't want to do that. I got into hotel management, and within hotel management, I realized you know what I want to do is become a chef. Oh so wow! Food. I've got celery. I've chopped some garlic. Like roughly chopped. There is nothing roughly about the way you cut vegetables. You cut them very beautifully. It's okay. It's called roughly cut. Beautiful. Nice. This is pretty much it. We should start now. So okay. some butter. So a little bit of oil. 
goes in there so that the butter doesn't burn. All right, I'm adding some peppercorns. Nice. I'm adding onion, garlic, and celery together. Okay. Nice. I love the sizzle of butter. It's looking so beautiful. Yeah. All right. Now it's going to be cooked very well. Let the carrots saute a little. Now, my pasta plum. Just cut them in small pieces. So you're going to cook these plums inside this? Yes. Yum. So the plums go in. Look nice. at all those nice colors. Nice. Now, if it's so good in soup, it won't be good. I would, I would have this. All right. I'm adding some salt. Nice. This is pretty. Is that nice? Yeah. Gorgeous. So. At this stage, we'll add some flour. We'll add some hot water. All right. Take a while. So we're adding some rosemary. rosemary in there. So my grandmother's name is Rosemary. Really? Yes. Interesting. Okay. So let's cover this and forget it for a while. Up next, we've got the carrot and plum soup boiling away. Yeah. Then we've got the pumpkin inside there. Now let's work on the stuffing. Done. Stuffing ke andar hum dalenge ye soya bean okay. which we've soaked. Then we'll toss it into a nice uh, tomato sauce. Nice. Yeah. So I've got some onions. We've got some garlic again, just the way it is. We've got some celery. We've got some sage. Sage. So I'll just drop it. Put it in. The way it is. So I have some oil. So I'm adding uh, onion, okay. garlic, celery, and sage all together. We'll just stir it a little. Okay. मेरे पास ये सोया बीन की जो कीमा है, इसको मैं स्क्वीज करके, I'll just drain out the excess water. So this is the drain one. All right. You don't have to brown it. Okay. इसके अंदर हम डालेंगे ये हमारा सूप सोया बीन. It's lovely texture, ना? It is. It gives a like beautiful meat. texture, yeah. Some salt. I like some chili powder. Yeah. So tell me, आपके अलावा आपके घर पे जितने लोग हैं वो भी foodie हैं? Your kids, Arshad? Yes. In fact, um, I've just learned to cook now about eight years ago. Huh. But the person who used to actually cook in my house was Arshad. He's a fantastic cook. You can cook? Very, very well. Fantastic. So I'm adding some tomato puree. Yep. Nice and red and meaty. Lovely. Yep. Go ahead. So I'm adding some pepper. I've added some salt. Let's see our soup. It's thickening up. It is time that we Put turn off. it off. And let it cool. Yeah. Take off the lid. Yeah. Allow it to cool a little before we blend it. It looks good as it is. <laughs> इसके अंदर थोड़ी सी सेज और डाल दो। Alright, so now we'll puree the soup. Alright, let's turn this off. Alright, so nice. Wow, let's put it back on fire. It's a beautiful color. I'm gonna put some water in. Yeah. Can you add some water? Yeah, that's it. That's it. Should be good. You don't even need cream in such beautiful soups. Beautiful. Nice. I'm adding some salt. We've got this beautiful soup ready. So this nice velvety carrot and plum soup. Got this nice plum. So I'll just garnish it with the plums. We've got some parsley. All right. So the carrot and plum soup is ready. Let's just place it onto the other table. All right. Let me check the pumpkin. It should be done. Yes, it is done. Nice. They look good. Looks really good. I really like the way the 
garlic and the herb is just burnt off, giving a very nice flavor. So, while they're still hot, what you can do is just take off whatever is burnt and then fluff them up with the fork. At this point, just add a little bit of butter. It works for the pumpkin very well. This much? Or would yeah. you like some more? A little more, no? Yeah, yeah. Remember, we have to. Yeah, eat. we have to run accordingly. Okay, run. This is just 100 meters. <laughs> Without oh, so you scraping add your... the skin. Okay. Yeah. Now you can. I'll do this with the other one as well. And then what we'll do is add the butter. I'll add some salt, some pepper. That's it. And we'll just mix it. Oh, it's so good! It's got that full flavor of the garlic and everything. Yes. It's yum. Yes, yes, yes. Just add it back. Nice. It looks yum. It is yummy. All right, this is done. Now, our soya wali sauce, chunky sauce, humne hai, comes on top. We don't press it. Let it be the way it is. We lift it over here and we cover it literally with, with cheese. cheese. I've got some cheddar. Nice. And some yellow cheddar just to add a little bit of that color. And that different sharpness. Different. Yeah. Pick this up, put it there. Similarly, we do it with the second one. There's some cheese on the tray. Let's avoid it because it starts it burning. Burn. Now, this goes inside the oven till the time the cheese doesn't melt. It should not take more than five minutes, five to ten minutes. So, while I put this inside the oven, why don't you guys go take a break and come right back to my yellow table where me and Maria will finish this menu.